Greetings my friends, thanks for tuning in. A few weeks ago I saw a video of a fellow YouTuber, where he told a story that he stopped collecting Hot Wheels, because he found a brand that was much better. I have to admit that video got my attention, so I wanted to try out myself what this was all about. The brand he was talking about was Mini GT, so I looked around in the internet for a bit and placed my order. I was fortunate enough to get myself a black Lamborghini and a yellow Corvette. The first difference is very obvious. While Hot Wheels are sold on carts, you will get your Mini GT in a box. But the packaging is not very important when you buy a car. As soon as you get it out of the box, you will realize there are more differences. It seems to be true. The Mini GT has more details than a typical Hot Wheels car. But is it worth the money? Hard to tell. It depends very much on what you are looking for. These cars have more details and are of a higher quality than your typical mainline Hot Wheels car. But they cost five times as much. But if you do compare them with the more expensive Hot Wheels cars, the price difference isn't so big anymore. Also, there's one other thing that you should keep in mind if you want to start a collection. Hot Wheels has hundreds, maybe thousands of different cars. You get pickups, trucks, sports cars, everything you want. From the latest hypercar to a classic vintage muscle car, Hot Wheels has them all. And right now I'm only talking about the Hot Wheels models made after real cars. If you also want to collect the super crazy cars of Hot Wheels own design, you can add another thousand to your collection. Mini GT on the other hand is more serious. Right now you only get a few cars, but very well made. And I'm pretty sure they will add to their collection as time goes by. Okay. Now it's time for a side-by-side -side comparison. Lucky me, I also got a Liberty Walk Lamborghini in my Hot Wheels collection. As for the Corvette, I guess another model has to do. It is close enough, I hope. Maybe the first thing you will notice are the missing mirrors on the Hot Wheels Lamborghini. A car without mirrors. How can it be? A very big difference we will also find at the rear end of the cars. It is the wing, or the lack of it. While the Mini GT cars in fact have wings. With Hot Wheels it's just part of the main body. This is in fact one of the most interesting differences. It shows us very well for what kind of buyers these cars are intended. Hot Wheels cars are toys. You can race them down the track and you can crash them. They will take it. The Mini GTs look much better. There can be no doubt about it. But they have lots of fragile parts that will break. These are not cars you will give to your kids to play with. You put them on a shelf and look at them. Is it fair to compare these two brands? Not really. They may have the same size. But they are very different. If you want high speed racing on a track in your living room, go for Hot Wheels. These cars can take a beating. But if you just want a fine little car that looks great, pick the Mini GT. And that's it. That is my final verdict. But as always, I would like to know what you think. Please let me know in the comments for the video. What are you collecting? Is it Hot Wheels, Mini GT, or something very different? I really would like to know. And if you subscribe to the channel, I will talk to you again soon.